Fox Sports Ohio. Cavalier offense looking for more production tonight as we talked about to you in the open. They go to Sean Kemp right away for the easy throw down. This is Doug Christie. Will not triple. Henderson tried to keep it alive and did to Brevin Knight. Cavs looking for numbers on the run. Person, good find is Sean Kemp who will bring it down with some power at the offensive end. Well, there's some. Reggie Slater hit a both from the line, so the Raptors are staying right there. They won four of their last five here at home. Person trying to catch that hot hand. Sean Kemp will throw down the uh, loose change that he picked up. As far as I'm concerned, but it, it, it's become an epidemic. All the carrying of the basketball. Sean Kemp has his fourth throw down here in the first half as that high lock and lob from Brevin Knight. Sean with the two personal fouls tonight, so is again going to be kind of almost uh, with a plea to his teammates to uh, let's come out with a lot of energy and establish. Mike Fratello setting up his offense with Ogalskis up high. Sean Kemp whirling baseline. Strong finish. Just kept took it with some purpose. You see Sean Kemp looking at that uh, high-low game that the Cavaliers started in quarter number one. Ilgowskis, good find of Sean Kemp, powered it up and down, plus one from the line. Interior passing, big man, big man. And that was an outstanding pass by Zadrudis Ilgowskis, who caught that ball with just about five seconds on the shot clock and then just floated that in just the right spot for Sean Kemp to catch and finish. The interior defense of the Raptors is really susceptible to good interior passing. If your Kale's with the ball, doesn't matter. Instead of at that point, trying to take his man one-on-one. -on -one. Sean Kemp wants it down there. He's got position on the low block with that quick turning jumper that goes. Very decisive from Sean Kemp. And that's a big reason why they've had this little turnaround seven and seven lately because of the play of those two off the bat. Sean Kemp going to put his shoulder down and took it strong to the rack. Slater has leaked out at the other end. Towards him, let him try to make his one-on-one -on -one play and stay home with the most dangerous player, Damon Stoudemire. Gauskas was double G with that spinning jumper in the paint. Sean Kemp, a sweet left-handed tip that fell twice. He way, but I think Person needs to join Kemp a little bit and jump things up a little bit. The nature of Wesley Person's game is people usually have to set plays up for him, set screens, draw and kick to him. Sean Kemp had those offensive rebounding stats. Yeah, he is. Throw it up and go get it again. Side of the floor. Christie going to go strong to the hoop. Reggie Slater is from Sean Kemp in traffic. Going to get right back to the free throw line. Hey, what, Matt, there, Kemp was uh, man-sized as he was in a crowd of four Raptor shirts, and none of them were close to getting the basketball as Sean gained control. And you said in traffic, and that's where he was, and not just tapping it to himself or anything like that, going up there, tapping it once, but that second time when he finally had it in his sights, making sure that he grabbed it hard, not getting stripped underneath the basket. Can one like this where Sean, as we talked about earlier, saying that he needs to get into it early with this kind of production tonight, can, can this propel him maybe on a uh, on a run to go into this next? Now, as we said, tonight starts 7 of 9 on the road to finish the month of February. Cavaliers will need their brain man leaders to step it up. Well, this is what he did a lot in Seattle the last uh, six or seven years there. Get on 